Hey everybody, uh, welcome to another episode of Dave's Corner. Now today on this episode, I'm going to be doing a quick review of my newest purchase, which is the Yeti Hondo Base Camp Chair. Now, we're not going to confuse this chair with the newer Yeti chair that you can pick up at your local sporting goods store, like Academy Sports and Outdoors. They sell the Yeti Trailhead Camp Chair. It is constructed completely different, and um, it's, it, to me, this chair here is just far more superior than the newer chair. Uh, that being said, uh, before I get too deep into this video, if y'all wouldn't mind, give me a like, uh, subscribe to my channel. Uh, that way I can reach out to more people out there in YouTube land. Uh, help my analytics uh, pick up. Uh, the more likes I get, the more subscribers I get, the more YouTube will share my videos with more people when they start searching for things. But, because uh, I'm not sponsored, I don't get paid to do these videos. Uh, I'm not sponsored by Yeti. I'm not sponsored by Academy Sports and Outdoors. Uh, when I do my videos, like the ones I've done on the, the Frosty Vault and the, 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 the Ice Box 35 down there, both Magellan coolers. I've got videos on both of them. Uh, go check those out. Uh, but I don't get paid or anything uh, to do these. Uh, they don't come to me free. This is out of my own money that I work my butt off for. So if you wouldn't mind, help my channel out a little bit. Anyway, um, this here, like I said, is the Hondo Base Camp Chair from Yeti. Uh, is it exclusively bought at yeti.com. You cannot buy this chair anywhere else but yeti.com. Uh, some people may not even know about this chair because when they go to their local store like Academy or wherever, all they might see is the, the other chair, which is the Trailhead Camp Chair. Uh, and it, but there is another chair. You just have to go to yeti.com to get it. And to me, like I said, this is the better chair. And I'll tell you why. It's got a wider uh, base to it. Uh, your sitting space here not, uh, is uh, 21 inches wide. Uh, your sitting space on the trailhead chair, 19 and a half inches wide. And you might think, well, that don't seem like a whole lot. But I'm gonna tell you something, people. When you uh, go sit down in these, this one here, sit down real easy, and I'm comfortable. Uh, the other chair, the trailhead chair, I tried sitting down in it at Academy uh, Sports, and I just felt confined in it. Uh, it didn't have the room on the sides. It, it, it you know, it just, I, I just felt confined in it. And when you're thinking about dropping three hundred twenty-five dollars, and that's with tax included and on everything. It's supposed to be a leisure chair. You're supposed to be able to go outside and be comfortable in it. You're supposed to be able to go to the lake and be comfortable. You're supposed to be able to go to the bonfire, be comfortable. Your, your barbecue, be comfortable. Wherever you're using this chair at outside, you want to be comfortable. And I just did not feel comfortable in the trailhead chair. Now, I'm a bigger guy. I weigh about 260 pounds. So... That chair was just not right for me, even though it says it hold, it can hold up to 500 pounds. Uh, Yeti uh, narrowed the chair, but it still says it holds up to 500 pounds. I mean, it might still hold 500 pounds, but I don't see it holding a 500 pound person, because a 500 pound person is gonna be a lot wider than what that chair is actually able to handle. Uh, like I said, I'm 260 and I felt confined in it, but this one here, I'm good. Now, I will give y'all an example. Uh, I think my own opinion, if you weigh over 220 pounds, you need to be going to Yeti.com and getting the Hondo chair. If you're 220 pounds and below, you could probably be happy with the base camp chair. I mean, it's a nice looking, clean looking, really sharp looking chair. Uh, it just wasn't for me. And uh, you know, another one of the kickers to me on this chair is the cup holder. This has got a solid plastic cup holder that is detachable. 
uh, really heavy duty, just like everything else that Yeti makes, and really easy, obviously, to hook back up. I didn't even look to see where I was going with it. And uh, got it hooked back up. Now, uh, but that's another one. I really like that. Now, the, the trailhead chair, it's like a lot of these other chairs. It's got the, the fabric uh, cup holder, uh, which then you got to fiddle around and try to get your cup in. And then it's not going to hold all your cups. This here holds all your cups. This one here will hold your low balls up to your 30 ounce King Crab Horn Yeti tumblers. Uh, your chair, your, your, your chair arms, uh, and your armrests, man, these things here feel great. I mean, it's like silky smooth feel to the touch. Uh, it just feels like really high quality. It's like, I mean, it, you almost want to say it feels, it's butter smooth, you know. It just, it's really soft feel, but it's hard plastic. It's kind of weird, uh, but it's, it's awesome. Another thing about this, it's the old timey fold up, you know, where you can just fold it up and go. And you see, my Yeti is still in my cup holder. I did not have to pick it up and move it. I can leave it there as I'm walking back to the car or as I'm leaving uh, my vehicle and going to the campsite or wherever I'm going, I can leave my, my drink in there. I don't have to carry it with my other hand. It frees up a whole nother hand. Uh, other than that, uh, you know, the mesh material, uh, it won't fade in the sun. It is, it, 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 they say, like I said, it hold up to 500 pounds. Uh, it won't, it's not supposed to rattle up on you. These chairs are supposed to have a five year warranty, just like everything else Yeti does. Uh, but I, I really feel like this chair is going to last a lot longer than five years. And even if it don't, I'd probably go out and spend the money again. It's just that nice feeling of a chair. Uh, the solid steel construction of it, when you sit down to this, you feel comfortable. You do not feel, even as a bigger guy, uh, you do not feel like this thing is going to budge one inch. You do not feel like it's going to collapse on you. Uh, it don't wiggle, it don't rock, uh, it's, it's solid. Uh, it's just a really great made chair. Uh, so, that being said, people, uh, go out and get you one. If, if you got $325 to go drop on a chair, uh, this one here would be the one to go for. Uh, that's my opinion. Uh, I feel like uh, between this chair here and the trailhead chair, I feel like this here is the better chair. Uh, even though the trailhead chair, it does come with a, a bag to carry it around with. It's got the backpack straps, stuff like that, you know, whatever. Uh, I still feel like even with that coming with that, this here is still the better chair. Uh, so that being said, uh, I'm going to cut this video off and uh, like I said, uh, give me a like and subscribe uh, and uh, thank y'all for watching. This has been another episode of Dave's Corner and uh, I'm out.